so happy. I am so happy to wow. David is coming. All these years away from me was the most difficult thing in my life. Every day was a challenge. But I'm happy. I am so happy today. I can't wait to see you. Come here. What a soul is with this David. Everything here is David this, David that. I mean, my husband is his son in this family. Send Jasmine to go and find him. And she's the only one who always finds him. Mm, some friendship, eh? She'll be overjoyed to learn that David is arriving tomorrow. My sister, can I go and tell her now? I'll see you later. Bye bye. Hello. <laughs> oh, girl. I'm so excited. <laughs> it's your son who is coming back home, but why should he appear soon? Mama is my friend, and David and Jasmine are childhood friends too. They are both adults now. Anyway, this and this, which one do you think will fit me? Yes, ma'am. Where is he? Uh, he said he's going to see Jasmine. You wanted to be the first to set your eyes on David. But it's Jasmine now. Welcome. Uh, how are you? I'm good. We were eagerly waiting to see you. And you should see your mother too. Have you seen her already? She has prepared... Jasmine around. Yes, she is. Jas, how have you been? Don't you want to see how I look? We are meeting after so many days. Days? <laughs> Maybe that's for you. For me, it's been 17 years four months, two weeks, five days, six hours, 23 minutes, and 12 seconds. And you never missed me. I did. Lies. You only wrote me five times in 17 years. You could have written every year. At least one. Yeah. That makes sense. Means you're a big girl now. 
And if you're a big girl, why don't you show me your face? I fear I will leave you breathless. Breathless? I have been breathless for 17 years. It's time I start breathing again by seeing your face. No. All right, fine. I stayed 17 years without seeing you. And I'll be fine if I don't see you for a day. Jasmine, I hate the thought of losing you. Here. I don't want to see him. Come on, Mom. Be angry. I said I don't want to see him. Tell him to go back to where he's coming from. Ma. Go, David. I don't want to see you. What is so ugly about this face? that neither you or Jasmine don't want to see. Hmm? After 17 years of waiting, someone else gets to see you first. Go. Go back to your Jasmine. So, don't you want to open your eyes? Don't you want to see how I look? No. Okay, fine. I'll leave this house and never return. David, where are you going? David, stop! David! Why did you let him leave? I was only joking. I was only joking, Mom. <laughs> Look at you! My prodigal son retains a lawyer. Has not stopped his mischief. <laughs> Good. I miss you, baby. <laughs> so, um, where is father? Oh, your father left for his chambers earlier. Something urgent. Hmm, I know. Always something urgent. The day I left his house, he wasn't home. The day I returned, he's still not home. What a lovely father. Come on, David. You know, government is honoring him. Mm, really? Mm -hmm. Mm, good. He will be so happy to see you, I know. <laughs> really? My father would have left everything for this day. His father would do anything for him. Come on, <laughs> let me show you what I got for you. Yeah, <laughs> so if he doesn't meet you at all. No, it wasn't a problem for him not to welcome me home after 17 years. I don't think it's going to be a problem if he doesn't find me home. David. Oh, You're going to just me, right?
morning, ma. Ah, Jasmine. Yes, ma. How are you? Fine, ma. Mm, it's been a while. <laughs> yes, ma. Jasmine, we haven't seen you in this house for ages. Suddenly, David returns and we see you. Please, where is he? Where is really the if no is one? Mm. So, what brings this moon to the earth? To take your breath away. <laughs> How generous. What is it? My excuse. Excuse? You brought my favorite food? Why don't you find out yourself? Empty. Goodness. This is your temper. You are a typical example of hot temper. You never change. You too. How? How? Unsophisticated. Why won't you talk like that? You are the one who just returned from London after 17 years. London is entirely different. Beautiful city. Huge buildings, a quaint palace. People in London live in a world of their own. And you? <laughs> what would you expect? I'm from London. You didn't miss home at all. Nah. I'm back in London. When someone screamed at me, I uh, remind me of my father. Now that's so funny. And whenever I'm having sleepless night, and I think of my grandma who sang sweet songs of melody to me to put me to sleep. That's just it. David. Hmm? And? And? What about me? You. Never thought about you for once. Never. Maybe once, that. Uh, oh, really, I have not You mean I never came to mind? No. Like they say, only what matters comes to mind. True. Very true, David. You are the only one that matters. There are times I missed you. When? Can I remember you when you never left my mind? You counted all the days without thinking that every second that passes by, I was the one suffering for being away from you. Not a minute that passes by without your thought. In my mind. The thought of you kept me alive. Want to come back to you.
that's right. Juliet was saying David and Jasmine are up to something. I don't like it when she comes here. They spend more hours together and only God knows what they've been doing. And her mother, she's there dreaming about David getting married to Jasmine. That is why it's called daydreaming. Because they never come true. I'm not going to sit by and watch my family's name dragged in the mud. Why? Tell me. Those people are rich. The attrition standard is high. We are poor. What makes you think we come to our level? What's wrong with your sister? She's pretty and educated. And besides, David loves her. Really, Mom? Yes. Soon. And I mean very soon. They'll come and ask for a hand in marriage. Hmm. Who are you? And how do you know my name? Bruce, I'm sorry. Um, my name is Michael. I'm sorry, I don't know you. Hey, come on. Look, it takes a second to know somebody. That is, if you want to know the person. Um, sorry, my mother has sent me. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Listen. Okay, fine. Let me escort you. No, thank you. It's okay. No, 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 I, I insist. No, please, oh, don't follow me. It's okay. Don't follow me. Please. She's so beautiful. She, she's... She's so charming. She's so innocent. My girl, stop dreaming. If I learned anything in London, never give up on love. They say everything is fair in love and war. I can see you are going insane. You don't know anything about the power of my love. I love you, Jasmine. I love you. I know, but I promise I'll be back within two weeks. Why don't you want to work in your father's chambers? I don't want to work with him. He's still your father. I know, but I said I don't want to work with him. David, this anger of yours is going to make you lose something very important someday. There's nothing more important to me. Than you. I don't want you to go. You waited 17 years for me. I'm sure you can still wait for just two weeks. Hi, Jasmine. Are you following me? No, I was just taking a stroll in the neighborhood. Please, leave hey. me alone. All I want is to be your friend. That's all. I just came back from London no long ago. London? <laughs> yes, London. <laughs> um, then... You know David. David. London is a very big city. You can't know everyone there. He lived there before. 
Well, I would love to meet him. He's not around at the moment. Where did he go? He traveled. Okay, then probably next time. Okay, um, friends? Good afternoon, Mom. Good afternoon. Please, is Jasmine around? And you are? My name is Michael. Michael Bonsu. And Jasmine is my friend. Jasmine. Jasmine. You have a visitor. Come out. What are you doing here? I brought you something. Meet my my friend. What's your name again? Michael. Michael. Michael, meet my mother. Nice to meet you, Mom. Same here. <coughs> Join us when you are done in the market. Yes, ma. Let's go. What are you doing here? I brought you this. Please, I'm begging you. Don't come to my house again. But why? My mother. But your mother seems okay with me. You know what? Just go inside and dress up. I'm taking you out for shopping. For? For shopping. No, I won't go, sorry. I have to go to the market to help my mother. But it's not going to take any time. OK, afterwards, you can go to the market. No, sorry, I can't go. Okay. I think I'll be sitting here till tomorrow then. Um, okay, okay. You, it's okay. You go. Come back tomorrow. I'll go with you. I can't go today. Promise. I promise. You just go, go. I promise. Oh, yeah. If you have to take it. Take it. Let me escort you. No, no, it's okay. You go up. Take your lead out. I'll go. I'll go and meet you.
This is, this is nice. Look. Look. This it will look good on. Can I take it? No. I think it will fit you. Yeah, take it. <laughs> Whoa. Okay. You can even add this one to it. Just like my sleeves. Wow. I'm going to be looking. <laughs> the evening meal oh mom what do you always shut up and do as you are told out sorry <laughs> so he bought all this for you <laughs> yes ma why is he doing all this i don't know i guess out of friendship Friendship. You think he's doing all this because of friendship? Yes. He loves you. Oh, ma. How? No. He's just my friend. And he's just being nice to me. You're still a child at the breast. His eyes is saying something else. Jasmine, don't give him hope if you know nothing will happen between the two of you. Mm. Why are you doing all this, Michael? She want to know the truth. Yes. Do you believe in love at first sight? Yes, I do. The very first day I saw you, I fell in love with you. Mom was right. I couldn't, I couldn't stop thinking about you. Michael, you are a good man. I'm sure there are lots of... Come on. My heart goes for only one person, and that is you. I'm sorry, Michael. I don't have a heart to give you. Someone has already taken it. David, right? This world doesn't exist without him. Like the lion rules the jungle, David rules my heart. I loved him even before I knew what love is. I'm sorry, Michael. I can't love you. It's best we don't see each other again. Jasmine, wait. But we can be friends, right? Good morning, Ma. Good morning. Please, is Jasmine around? No. I'll send her to do something for me. Okay. Um, please, when she comes back, tell her I came here. Okay, I would like you to take my leave now. Uh, Emma, what do you want with my daughter? What can I say? She means the world to me. She means everything to me. She cannot give you love. I know. I know her hand belongs to someone else. Mm. You have to forget her. Eh? Nothing will come out of it except paint. Thank you.
your face. David, this love will be your destruction. You see, you see how childhood friendship has turned into a youthful romance. This is not romance. Go diggers. They think they can use my son. <laughs> but I'll put she and that her mother exactly where they belong. Nonsense. Hmm? I only have to put in a little fuel. David's mother just sent for me. Mm -hmm. She says I should come. So we discuss your marriage. <laughs> me. Mm -hmm. <gasps> my dear, I am so happy. The day you marry David will be my happiest day. I'm so happy, my sister. Finally, Jasmine will be marrying. <laughs> yes. I'm so happy as well. You know, Jasmine is a very good girl. We must make sure she marries a responsible husband. Well, who can be a better husband to her than our own David? Are you out of your mind, Amma? I called you here so we could find a nice way for her. And you're already dreaming about being part of my family. You are right, Juliet. She does know how to take opportunity. As a child, her daughter stole food from our garden. And now she wants to steal the prince of this house. No. That's not true, sister. David and Jasmine had loved each other since they were children. We can't live without each other. Maybe you never noticed it, but I know the year for each other. Please, sister, don't separate them. Even if it means you having nothing to do with me. What do I have to do with you? I just pity and try to be nice with you, and you are already taking advantage of that. You don't even deserve to be my household. Oh, sister. It's okay, mother-in-law. We can always talk to David. He knows the family status. But what can poor old God do? How dare you, Amma? Enough, Jane. I saw you as my sister. But now, it's over. You talk of class. Were you born into a rich family? You stand here to talk about class? I used to hold you in high esteem. Little did I know that you're so narrow-minded as to remembering her stealing fruits from your garden. Ah, count. Tell me, how many fruits did she steal from your garden? Tell me, count. I fed your son, David, many times more than your count of stolen fruit. Yes. We are below your family class. But love does not know class. Of course you didn't know, because you're so deaf not to listen to your son's heartbeat. Blind enough not to see the alarm. And soon, you will witness your son's destruction. I promise you this. 
adjustment will marry into a good and a rich family. talking about? I don't want to see you and David ever again. Ma. of what people will say or think. I don't care what people will say or think about me. All that matters is I am with you. What brings you here this late? Why does the mountain go to Mohammed if he doesn't go to the mountain? Why does the fisherman go to the sea? Why does the sunflower face the sun? Why am I here regardless of my dignity? Why did I come here even when my mother forbids me? Why did I walk through the dark night just to come and see you? Why do I seek refuge in you? Too many questions to be answered. As long as we are together, nothing matters. Yeah. But that's what they don't want. see it from our perspective. We can win him over. What if he doesn't agree? There is love. There is no fear. Where there is smoke, there is always fire. And I don't want it to consume us. What are you saying? When the dog is wary of the dog, it's kicked out of. But you, psst, what you can't get away during the daytime, you try at night. Why don't you and your mother just open the brothel? Even a pimp would not advise someone like that. Damn it!
went to that house after all the humiliation that I went through the little owner left in our family is going to throw it under their feet I only went to ask ask him what and what reply did you get huh I'm not going to repeat myself again this is the last time I'm going to say this to him to return it. This marriage is not happening. There is nothing to stop this marriage. Don't you forget who it is you're talking to. Of course I know who I'm talking to. I'm talking to a rich, arrogant man who will send his fellow man's daughter to the brothers. A gentleman's daughter will never sneak into the room of a neighbor in the middle of the night. You, you compelled her. Enough, David. I don't want to argue with you. Neither do I. Fine, then this case is dismissed. I object. Don't you realize our family status is far higher than this? Yet we all work on the same sword. Our name, our status, everything. Yet when we die, we all go six feet under. A bird and a fish can never have a religion. This man of earth will let God in heaven. How dare you? David. I said. I object. Jasmine, there is so much I have to say. Last night, I lost all my sense of reasoning. I know you wouldn't want me to displease my father and make you happy, would you? Why does the fisherman go to the sea? Why does the sunflower face the sun? Instead of looking for answers, why not let the question pass? What is between us is nothing but childishness. There is no love. From now on, you are just my childhood friend. like I've never loved anyone. She loves someone else. Oh, make her forget him. You will only ruin your life with this madness. I am already ruined without her.
sorry, okay? All right, Emma, please meet my bro, Dave. And David, this is Emma, my friend. Hey, sexy. You're gonna have a really good time here, sexy. Sure, my boy. You know it's rude to leave without saying goodbye. Smoking, drinking, sleeping with men for the money. It's shameless. You're a woman, Emma. A woman is a mother, a wife, a sister, and a friend. And if she's none of these, then she's a whore. What are you, Emma? Here, for your time wasted. Excuse me, I'll leave the two of you. What are you doing here? I always look tomorrow is my wedding. You can't get married. Why not? Because we're meant to be together. <laughs> because we are meant to be together. What happened to whatever that exists between the two of us is nothing but childishness. I was a fool to have written that letter. You know your David when he gets angry. I made a mistake. Oh, it's too late. I object. Never do it. It doesn't make a difference to me. I have to go.
Why do you drink this? This. <laughs> it frees your head and gives you absolute control of your emotions. It takes away every pain. Just like what I see in your eyes. Would you want to try some? Without you, baby, I don't wanna live without you, baby. It's now or never, now or never, baby. It's now or never, now or never, baby. I don't wanna be without you, baby. Yeah. I don't wanna live without you, baby. It's now or never, now or never, baby. It's now or never, now or never, baby. I don't wanna be without you, baby. I don't wanna live without you, baby. It's now or never, now or never, baby. I will never, 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 baby. I don't wanna be with you. Oh. Oh. My head. Finally, you're awake. What are you doing here? Well, she found you lying unconscious last night and brought you here. Anyway. Here is something for you to drink. 
And who is Yasmin? You kept calling her name all night. It's none of your business. Anyway, how's your headache? Bad. Looking at you, I feel so bad. Why must it be you to be the only person to rescue me? why Yasmin left you. You don't even deserve sympathy. That was harsh, man. You have to apologize to her, David. Sorry. Today was supposed to be ours. You and me. But obviously he was there. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry, Michael. Say something. Obviously, he's not ready to apologize. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have said all those things. 
I'm really sorry. Come on. Let's go have some drinks. Come on. Let's go. Send the bus and the nibba van a boy get you a dick at the line. The future man rock on. Capasta. Wallace. TV a man a wall. I need a wash a bun so. Then I wash a bun so. Oh yeah, but I call you. I call the bottom of shit call low. Tell the man. I call shit call air mo. I call the bottom of and and go. Tell the man. Oh yeah, blow my. Oh, put you to your name, go man. Tell the 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 man. Oh yeah, but I call you. I call the bottom of shit call low. Wishful drinks are still within your limit. <laughs> I drink to stay on. I drink to have the courage to look you in the face. To tolerate you. I drink so I could forget Jasmine. No. What? After all the drinks, I still can't get her out of my mind. Why? Why are memories haunting me? Hmm? Why are memories tormenting me? Why? Just one, one small, small mistake. Why this harsh punishment? Hmm? Huh? What? What? Oh. 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 No, 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 don't, don't, don't touch me. Don't touch me. I don't like you. You have reduced womanhood to nothing. Come here anymore. I'm done. <laughs> Anytime I think about Jasmine, I'll come back. to go from here. There's no way. No way to go. I've sentenced myself already. David, why punish yourself like this? Because every day, this heart is put to try. Every day, this romance is tried. I object. <laughs> but the verdict remains the same. I object. And it goes like, David, you're found guilty for loving Jasmine. And you are hereby sentenced to life in torture and torment. And I go like it. <laughs> yes, my lord. No objection. No, no 
Why this punishment? Just for love? So why are you doing this to me? Why are you doing this to me? Two years. It's been two years and every day this pain. The pain of loving you. can I do? Hmm? That's, that's the only thing I have. Please don't say that. Please. You have me. to offer you nothing no home no heart nothing please don't love me please i already have I'm looking for David. I know he's inside. Joshua. How did you find me here? Your father. He doesn't want to see me. He doesn't want to see my face. <laughs> this is like this. This only. Go. Let's go and tell him I'm fine. Your father is dead. was a good man, a very good man. <laughs> <sighs> 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 
such men. Never mind. <sighs> but he was a good man. He was a good man. We, 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 we used to love each other so much. So much. Let me go and pay my respect to him. Oh. Oh. Mr. Kofi Mens. You have a new title now. The late Mr. Kofi Mens. up to make. <laughs> Did you eat when you were leaving? Hmm? Not necessary. Let me go and talk to your wife too. Now that you're gone, who's going to look after her? Who? I will do your job for you. Yeah. <laughs> well, I will do your job for you. I will take good care of her. Very good. Hmm? good husband. He loves me so much. <laughs> it's good. So good. You've read it much older. Stop staring. Oh, what? I can't bear. Tears pouring from these eyes. Please.
I have to leave this place. And I don't know if I may return. I have to find myself. <sighs> How did we get here? I don't wanna be without you, baby. I don't wanna live without you, baby. It's now or never, now or never, baby. It's now or never, now or never, baby. I don't wanna be without you, baby. Yeah. Beautiful memories. Oh, why did we grow? I don't want to live without you, baby. I don't know. <laughs> Promise me you'll forget about me. Please. <sighs> You're a married woman. You've been here for a while now. I'm not leaving. I'm not leaving until you give me your word. I can't. Yes, you can. David. No, I can't. David, you can. No, I can't. David, you can do any and everything you put your mind to, please. Will you go away with me this night? Why is it? Will you elope with me this night? David, please. Will you elope with me this night? David, listen. Will you elope with me this night? Please, please. Stop it. I can't bear to see you like this, please. Stop drinking, but what I can do, promise you. Is that every day I pray to God that I see you one last time before I die. responsible for this. So before we lead you to West, just leave. Everybody said leave Jasmine. Father said leave for London. Jasmine said leave drinking. Now you say she leave this house. Her son. He would say, I should leave this world. <laughs> You've always been a part of me. Look, I've always been a part of you. Oh. 
اما اما I am officially declared the loneliest man in this world. Hmm. No father, no mother, no jasmine, no friends. No, nobody. No, nothing. Oh, only me. I don't know why he created love. Stupid love. I hope he didn't kill us. Once upon a time, you should have stayed away from all this. Look at you now. Eric, I wanted to listen to you then. Like now. But this... This doesn't listen to anyone. Who wants to live in this pain, Iris? Tell me. You have to let go of this. Let her go. Why should I have to? Why? Who cares where she goes? Wherever the hell she's from. She don't understand. She don't understand. Why does she see him? Why does she go somewhere? Or even another planet? She lives here. Here. This doesn't want her to go. He has refused to let her go. Yes. Is it one of to go? This is the last way to go. It's okay, bro. It's okay. This is the last way I understand. It's okay. I understand. I understand. It's okay. This is.
Vera, how are you? I'm fine, Mom. Told David Marine just now we bring sheep to our family. But now he's a disgrace to the family. And I'm responsible for it. I drove my son insane. David has never asked me for anything. He always wants to see me happy. You only wanted one thing, just me. But I couldn't give him the only thing he desires so much. Because of my ego. I destroyed my own son. What kind of a mother destroys her own child? Mama, you said it. That I will soon witness my son's destruction. I have. I have. <laughs> <laughs> I know she finally saw her heart. <laughs> Just like Jasmine. Oh, when we were kids, I would go and steal her doll. And she would come quickly after me. David, have you seen my doll? I'm like, no, 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 no. But I stole it. <laughs> 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 You're also a thief. <laughs> you just stole Jasmine. <laughs> you know, Jasmine is the most beautiful person I've ever seen. <laughs> With the most beautiful heart. You know, when I first saw her, the world stopped moving. <laughs> every time I set my eyes on her, everything ceased. She loves you. Oh you married her. <laughs> one, one.
your system. And even a drop of it is like a poison to you. If you want to survive, you have to stop drinking. Everything has been taken away from me. I don't know what stops him from taking me. Actually, I'm here. I'm here to see someone. Oh my God! It's been ages. Oh, well, whoever that person is, let him wait. All right? Come on, get in this car and let's go and have oh, some no, fun. No, 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 no. I, 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 I can't. You are not giving me any excuse. Let's. Oh. Let's drink, for old time's sake. No, I, I stopped drinking. <laughs> I don't drink anymore. Listen, for old time's sake, let's drink something. Come on, David, just this once. No, no. Come on, David, we've been friends for a very long time. I know you very well. Just this once for old time friendship. Old time friendship? Yeah, all the time friends. <sighs> for friendship, sake. <laughs> yeah, for friendship's sake. Uh. 
Emma. 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 never have this heart in his life. But in my next life, this heart would not breathe. Everyone's looking for, looking for the perfect sound, looking for someone to love and to be loved by someone. But when you find that someone, and can't be without someone, it hurts so bad, it hurts so bad. I wanna be with you and no one else. Oh, I wanna be. I want to be with you and no one Without you, baby. I don't wanna live without you, baby. It's now or never, now or never, baby. Sorry, Michael. I'm sorry for making you suffer. You loved me with everything in you, yet I couldn't return the love. God knows I tried. I tried to love you, but my love for David keeps growing every day. Staying with you only means I'm going to hurt you. I hope you find someone better than me. And please, please find it in your heart to forgive me. I'm so sorry. Goodbye, Michael.